CAR T cells is the biggest thing, so to speak. Um, you know, and I, and I presented the results of the um, uh, Transcend CLL 4 study, which is a which is a CLL uh, uh, which is a study in re relapsed refractory CLL patients who have all failed ibrutinib previously, and in fact, more than half have also failed venetoclax previously. So, pretty bad acting population, so to speak. They run, you know, they're running out of options, um, and the, the disease behaves more aggressively. So, we we treated 23 patients. Um, you know, with uh, Juno CAR T cells or lysocell, and uh, we found that the results were very encouraging. Um, high overall response rate, high CR rate, and actually undetectable MRD in the bone marrow and blood um, was pretty high at 60 to 65 percent as early as 30 days after CAR T cells. So um, it's an excellent option. Um, so far, I have probably. Um, We've seen about three or four patients beyond the 12-month mark who are all still in a complete remission with detectable uh, CAR T cells in their peripheral blood still, and also undetectable MRD for CLL, which is which is great.